Hello, today we're going to be making a porcupine out of Play-Doh. So you're going to need a tub of Play-Doh and you're going to need 15 toothpicks. And so what you're going to do, you're going to go ahead and you're going to open up the Play-Doh container and you're going to squeeze the Play-Doh out. And so you're going to have your, your child, you're going to have them make squeeze the Play-Doh in both of their hands, squeeze it nice and tight. just like that, and then you're gonna have them make a ball. You can do this with both hands, get both hands engaged, or if they have some trouble with that, they can also roll it around on the table, and if they have trouble with, with getting the coordination for that and the motor planning, you can put your hand over theirs and help roll it together, just like that. And so then you're gonna have them squish it down on the table, and then they can push their fingers into it to squish it, make it flat, and then we're gonna make a worm and roll that worm out. And then put it together and squish it. All right, and then we're gonna separate it. So we're gonna separate it into two, two balls. One is gonna be a small one, and then one's gonna be a big one. So we're gonna roll this into a smooth ball There we go. And then we're going to take this one and we're going to roll this one as well into a smaller ball. And we're going to connect them. So you can have your kids push it together like that. And so this is going to be the head of our porcupine and this is going to be the back. And so we're going to take our toothpicks and we're going to stick them into the porcupine's back to give him his quills. And so this activity, when we roll the Play-Doh, it helps warm up the fingers, the muscles in the fingers and the hands. And then when we put the toothpicks in, it's great fine motor work for working on pincer grasp and also riding utensil grasp. And as you can see, our toothpicks, you can't really get a fist around them, so you have to use your fingers. And so it helps our kiddos gain the, uh, build the muscles to, um, to hold riding utensils with, with age-appropriate grasps. So you're going to go ahead and push the quills in, and then you can also um, work on counting with this activity because you can count the, the quills as you push them in. So like that. And then you might want, you can also use another toothpick and you can draw a face. So two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. There it is. And so then as you clean up the activity, you can also, it also is a fine motor activity because then you need to pull them out. And depending upon how far in they went, it sticks to the Play-Doh and it gives a little bit of resistance. And it also continues to work on that pincer grasp. So have our kiddos pull them out. Just like that. And then you can have them squish the Play-Doh and then put it back in the container, push it in with their fingers and close it. Thank you so much and have fun with this activity.